Welcome to Star Citizen and the guide for the CCU Game Add-on. In the first guides to the free browser add-on CCU game by the German developer Rishwa, we already told you about the many possibilities, including the full hangar overview, the automatic calculation of upgrade chains and the significantly expanded functionality of the buyback. However, the new and significantly expanded CCU game app offers us the possibility to use even more features, to get a comprehensive insight into the development of Star Citizen, and at the same time to fall back on a simpler and more appealing user interface, without having to sacrifice any functions. So in this guide, we will show you all the functions of the CCU game app, the options available to you, the way to maximum savings via the calculated upgrade chain, as well as the new functions and features. But first of all, it is important to note that your account data will not be entered or stored in connection with the CCU game. To use the game, simply log in as usual at robotspaceindustries.com. Misuse is therefore impossible, especially since CIG employees have been in contact with the add-on developer for a long time. To put it simply, it is an extended and very comfortable possibility to view your entire account. So let's take a closer look at the possibilities and of course how you can get well over 50% savings on the standard price of ships via the automatic upgrade calculations. And like all guides in the channel, this one is completely modular and you can use the timestamps in the video to jump to the parts that interest you or which you want to see again. But first of all, a big thank you to the real ladies and gentlemen who make this video possible with their support as Patreons, channel members or Twitch subscribers. Thank you! On the ccugame.app page, we can either create a completely free account or access the application without entering any data. However, it is a prerequisite that we have logged into robotspaceindustries.com with your account. Otherwise, no data can be updated since CCU Game cannot access your account data. One of the most useful functions is the full text search for your entire account, which can be found in the top bar. Here you can easily find everything in your account or in the pledge store. And as soon as you select the search result, you get a complete detailed overview of all available informations, including the corresponding links. But let's start with the possibilities of an absolutely free account. This allows you to store all your hangar information locally on your computer, specify the currency with or without taxes and import your data from the CCU browser add-on. In addition, we can reset the prices of our data, whereby the current price is retrieved directly from each item. This is especially useful for older accounts, as price adjustments take place regularly. Under the menu item, your items, we find all our ships in the hangar, on the left side, whereby we get extensively sorting, filtering and search functions, which gives us a total overview of all our ships and their respective data, including savings and insurance data. And of course, we can search not only in our active hangar, but also in our buyback directly for ships, packages or even individual size categories, or have them displayed collectively. And if we want to buy back an item from the buyback, we can select the item directly and a pop-up message to be confirmed will allow us to place this item from our buyback directly in our shopping cart. Other search and sort functions include ships or concepts that are already flight ready, the possibility of passing on the ship or whether a game package is included. And of course, we also have a search and filter function for different insurance length. Under the menu item CCUs, we have the overview in the hangar as well as the buyback of all upgrades in our hangar and buyback. Here we again get all the information about the savings in the upgrade, including insurance if applicable and whether it is a warbond upgrade. In addition, we get information about the total upgrade values of all CCUs in the hangar, whereby we again have the option of clicking on the individual upgrade to have it displayed directly in the hangar on robotspaceindustries.com or even to be able to buy it from the buyback. And with the menu item Paints and Equipment, we then also find all the other usable items with the corresponding filter and sorting functions. The other item is also interesting, as it allows us to search for special items or event rewards in the hangar. 
We can also find special concierge items or the new game packages for concierge members. However, CCU Game offers us not only an overview of our own hangar, but also of all available items in the pledge store. After which corresponding concierge levels, the subscriber status, current limited items as well as special unlocks are taken into account. This makes the search for corresponding ships, upgrades or items in general much easier. After we save a lot of time and effort via the full text search, or even by means of filtering, for example for time-limited warbond upgrades. And especially in the area of upgrades, we not only get the possibility to put them directly into the shopping cart, but also the indication which upgrades we already have available in the similar price range in our hangar or buyback. If we then want to add an upgrade to the shopping basket, we are given the additional option of specifying whether we want to choose a special ship for this upgrade or simply the cheapest ship that is permanently available. And this upgrade alone saves us a lot of research work. But also in the area of the game packages, the sorting and filter functions can be of great use, whereby we are given a calculated saving price, especially for reduced game packages, which is directly indicated depending on the ship, game package or additional features. This way, we can see at a glance whether a game package or offer in the pledge store would be a possible worthwhile purchase or a single purchase via an upgrade chain would be the better way. And as with our own items, all other items available to you can also be researched. The display for subscribe or concierge items, on the other hand, is tied to your account status. But we come to by far the most interesting feature, the automatic calculation of upgrade chains where we find some extensive options for personalization. For example, we can include individual upgrades in any case or leave them out of a chain, as well as save entire chains. In the calculation itself, we basically choose between a maximum saving, whereby new purchases with fresh money are also possible, or even the option of using only existing stock credits if possible, without investing new money. We can also specify whether the contents of our buyback can be included or whether we should still include upgrades that are not currently available. And with the selection of a starting ship, from which the upgrade starts, we can choose between an automatic selection in the current shop or our own selection from our hangar. Finally, we enter our target ship and can have our upgrade chain calculated automatically, which we can then save in our account. And so, we can design an upgrade chain that is perfect for us, buy it gradually as the upgrades become available and then ultimately realize ship prices with savings of well over 50%. Upgrades in our chain can then be added to our shopping cart with a single click, without having to search them out individually, which again saves us a lot of time and effort. We recommend that you wait for the various sales, which takes place especially at Invictus Launch Week in May and at the, the Galactic Aerospace Expo in November, to complete your upgrade chains one by one. This will give you the biggest savings. And in this Anvil Crucible with 60% savings, we take a look at one of such upgrade chains. Details on your upgrade chains can also be found under your items and the corresponding selection of the respective ship in the detailed view. Here you will find all applied upgrades, the corresponding value and also the date of the upgrade. You can also find special bonus items, name reservations or insurances. Another interesting feature is the search for unavailable or extremely limited ships, after which detailed information can be called up. But a brand new feature on the CCU game app is a very extensive and detailed statistic analysis which not only provides information on funding, player numbers or patch progression, but also can be filtered and searched. With this, individual sales or even individual offers from the pledge store can be highlighted and evaluated, and thus the interest of the community in various areas can be traced. Official data sources are used for this and are constantly updated and brought up to date and especially the view of the different patch periods, the release dates as well as the general development progress offer many possibilities and a good overview of Star Citizen.
And if we are still looking for negative effects, there is no. This is really completely free of charge. Therefore, a small thank you to the developer Ushua is a matter of honor. And of course, a vote in the Star Citizen Spotlight. And for questions about the add-on, feel free to drop by the Discord we left you in the video description, as well as the link for the tool himself. I say goodbye, until next time, see you soon and as always, see you in the verse.